May I start by saying that this movie was fucking awful. Screw? You know what? Just screw the intro. We're just gonna dive into this very, very horrendous movie. Okay, this movie was fucking horrendous. This is not what I expected from a sequel of Spirit of the Stallion of the Summer. Fuck. I'm sorry, I said the name wrong because I'm that mad. Because I absolutely hate this movie so much. It is so insulting to the original. It's practically a copy-paste of the said original. The characters are unlikable, except for maybe one or two. Abigail is the worst character in this movie. Lucky is an, an annoying character. Spirit barely acts like Spirit from the original. And yeah. <sighs> Honestly, this movie makes me so mad. I don't know why I went to the theater to see this, but everyone is way too incompetent or an asshole in this movie, for the most part, or acts way too out of character. Personality shift, it is just, it is so cliche to the point where I predicted every single plot line. Yes, it is that bad of a movie. Do not go see this, even as a joke. I am warning you, you will regret it. I hate this movie so, so much. Honestly, just do not go see this. I am warning you. The dialogue is just laughable. Honestly. I saw two families leave the theater while I was watching the movie, and I was close to doing it myself. Do not see this. Do not watch Spirit Untamed. It has fuck you written all over it. And I am serious about that. Well, literally speaking. Not literally speaking, figuratively speaking. I'm sorry. My words are messed up because I'm this pissed about this movie. It is so, so bad. So bad. It is, honestly, almost to the level of the Emoji movie. Almost. And that is saying something. I've never seen a movie this bad in a long time. Holy shit. It is horrible. Oh my god. Like, honestly. They use so many cliches in this movie, and this is made by the people who made How to Train Your Dragon 3, my favorite DreamWorks movie. Just, please, how do you go from that to this? It's like they were trying to make a bad movie and succeeded at it. Holy shit. I hate this movie. Do not go see Spirit Untamed. You will hate it. Even as a joke, it is not worth your money. Honestly, do not see this piece of shit. It's barely even a movie. It looks like a Nick Jr. preschool show. That's how bland the CGI is to me in this movie. The original was 2D and had a soundtrack that slapped hard and a story that was good. Here, no. No. The only redeeming things I could say about this is, I forget her name, but one of the main characters were likable. Not Lucky or Abigail. Abigail is absolutely the worst character in this movie. And I did find one of the scenes kind of entertaining. It was, like, the final battle scene, I guess. It was fine. It was a fine scene, I guess. It was entertaining. Not the best scene in cinematic history, but it was entertaining enough. Not to the point where it kept me on the edge of my seat, but yeah, I think you get my point. At least, at least this isn't as bad as Earwig and the Witch. Because if it weren't for those redeeming qualities I just gave out, yeah, it would have been the worst film of the year. And no contest to that. DreamWorks, I'm sorry, you gotta make better movies. I'm sorry. This was just, no, this wasn't it for you. Just... Wait for The Boss Baby 2 to come out, or The Boss Baby Family Business. I'm waiting for that. Please, please don't screw that up. I beg of you not to. Just don't. And please, stop milking the Spirit franchise. Spirit Stallion of the Cimarron is good. We don't need a Netflix series and some games. Honestly, this is the final nail in the coffin for the Spirit franchise. It's suffered enough. Just please, no more!